China has some really cool instruments. We're going to see an orchestra. And here's a question, Mrs. Nesbitt. Have you ever gone to see the orchestra in person before? Kind of, because I like to go to theater. Mm -hmm. So with theater comes an orchestra. Yeah, so if you're seeing musical theater, usually there's some kind of band, and the band has, it's almost an orchestra. Sometimes it is an orchestra. Uh, I've watched about every musical there is from Wicked to Lion King. Wicked and Lion King are great examples of musicals where the music that they use is totally different, right? Because Lion King, they actually try to be more African with the music that they have. Mm -hmm. And so they actually use some African instruments and a lot more percussion and drumming. And then in Wicked, it is an orchestra. So they have all of those orchestra instruments, violins and clarinets, and you played the clarinet, right? I did. So this next song that we're gonna hear from China is it's an orchestra, okay? So I just wanted to set you up for that. So it's, it's like an orchestra, like a band you might see in middle school, but the big difference is every instrument is different. They have the same basic families, like you know how a clarinet is a woodwind instrument. So in China, there's a woodwind section, but none of the instruments are a clarinet. Even though they look like a clarinet, they all have different names and they sound a little different. And in Chinese orchestras, they have a string section, but they also have a plucked string section, kind of like a section of all, of all guitars. <laughs> All right, I'll stop it there. So, Mrs. Nesbitt, what do we think about that music? It's definitely what I would hear as an orchestra. If you said, pick out the orchestra music, I would be able to pick this out. <laughs> <laughs> 